بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله حمدا كثيرا طيبا مباركا فيه كما يحب ربنا ويرضى اخوتي في الله ما هي آية الحجاب آية الحجاب اخوتي في الله what is the ayat of hijab? Hunaka ayatul kursi. Naam. Rada ayat laha asma. Some of the ayats of the Book of Allah they have names. Maya ayatul hijab wa ma tatadamanu ayatul hijab. What is the ayat of hijab? What does it entail? Naam. Halu shayin takhusun nisa. Is this something that's specific for the women? أخي في الله هو شرفك وهو عزتك. نعم. This is your honor. This is your integrity. الله سبحانه وتعالى ميزنا وشرفنا بهذه الآية الكريمة. الله سبحانه وتعالى has honored us and distinguished us with this ayat. هو آية الثالثة وخمسين. آية number fifty-three في سورة الأحزاب. قال الله تعالى يا أيها الذين آمنوا أو يه بليف لا تدخلوا بيوت النبي إلا أن يؤذن لكم don't enter the houses of the prophet except if he gives you all permission نعم before it was able was permissible to enter the house without permission نعم أن يؤذن لكم إلى طعام غير ناظرين أي منتظرين إدراك ناظرين إناه أي لا تدخل البيت قبل أن الطعام جاهز لا تأتي قبل الدعوة بساعة وبنصف ساعة ولكن تأتي والطعام ناضج Don't come to the house of the prophet for food and come way before the food is even ready نعم ولكن إذا دعيتم فدخلوا لكن if you are announced to come in and at that time not before the time that you are allowed to come in فإذا دعيتم فدخلوا فإذا تعم فإذا تعمتم فانتشروا if you finish eating the food you have to leave it's not suitable to stay around after you finish eating you should leave وكل هذا سيتبين عند الحديث. All this is going to come clear when we read the hadith. ولا مستأنسين لحديث أي لا يؤنس بعضكم بعضا بالحديث وبالكلام في بيت رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم بعد أن قد أكلوا. Don't sit in the house in the Prophet's house entertaining one another with speech. You haven't seen one another. You're happy to see one another. Naam, after you finish the food and you sit behind and you keep talking. Wahada Nazalat fi Walimati Zainat Zainab bin Tujashin. This came down concerning the Walima of the Prophet's wife, Zainab bin Tujash. In Nadarikum kana yu'zi an Nabiya sallallahu alayhi wa sallam in Nadarika kana yu'zi an Nabi fayastahi minkum. Wallah, la yastahyi min al-haq. That would annoy the Prophet. How did it annoy the Prophet? The Prophet just got married. He wants to be alone with his wife. And they're sitting around and they're talking in his house. Naam. The Prophet's muhraj. He's annoyed, but he's yastahyi. He's embarrassed to say, you have to go. It's time to go. Wallahu, ma yastahyi min al-haq. Ay, an ya'muru bil-haq. Allah is not embarrassed to command with that which is truthful. وَإِذَا سَعَلْتُمُوهُنَّ مَتَاعًا فَاسْأَلُوهُنَّ مِنْ وَرَاءِ حِجَابٍ هَذَا آيَةِ حِجَابٍ نعم. If you ask the Prophet's wife for something that you need, you have to ask them from behind the sitar بدون المواجهة. You can't be directly in front of them. ذَلِكُمْ أَطْحَرْ لِقُلُوبِكُمْ وَقُلُوبِهِنَّ That is greater for your hearts and their hearts. إلى آخر الآية. الحديث فيما يتعلق في هذا هو حديث أنس. قال أنس رضي الله عنه: 
ana a'lamun nas bi hadhihi al-aya ayat al-hijab i'm the most knowledgeable person concerning this verse the verse of the hijab Limada, why? He said, I am the most knowledgeable person concerning this verse. We're going to find out at the end of the hadith. Why? He said, I am the most knowledgeable. I know more about this ayat than anybody else. Allah to Anas. Shehittu walimata Zainab. Fa'ashba'an nas khubzan wa lahman. Lama uhdiyat Zainab ila Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. كانت معه في البيت صنع طعاما دعا القوم فقعدوا يتحدثون انس رضي الله عنه he said i witness i was present at the walima of zainab bint jash when she was when she got married to the prophet the prophet fed the people bread and he fed them meat until everybody ate zainab was with the prophet in the house there's no problem with ikhtilaf at that time. There's no mafi and fisal. There's no separation. Uh -uh. The people ate, but they sat down. They kept talking to one another. When the Prophet ﷺ married Zainab, he invited the people. They ate, but they sat and they kept on talking. So the Prophet act like he was getting up to do something, to go so they could get a hint. They didn't understand. فلم يقوم فلما فلما رأى ذلك قام for when he saw that they didn't recognize what he doing he actually stood up and left نعم فقام فقام من مع من الناس so some people got up they recognized and they left فبقي ثلاثة three people stayed behind ما أدركوا they didn't recognize وَإِنَّ النَّبِيَّ صَلَّى اللَّهُ عَلَيْهِ وَسَلَّمَ جَاءَ لِيَدْخُلْ فَإِذَا الْقَوْمُ جُلُوسٌ The Prophet went out, and some of the narrations went to all his houses. وَسَلَّمْ عَلَيْهِ على every bait and every bait قال وَعَلَيْكُمْ سَلَامٌ كَيْفَ وَجَدْتَ أَحْلَكَ كُلُّ زَوْجٍ قال كَيْفَ وَجَدْتَ أَحْلَكَ نعم وَبَرَّكَهُ عَلَى زَوَاجِهِ He went to every house, and every wife said, you know, هَنَّأَهُ عَلَى زَوَاجِهِ Say, how did you find your wife? And he came back. He wants to enter and be with his wife. He finds the people still sitting there. ثم إنهم قاموا فانطلقوا ثم after a while they got up and left. فجئت فأخبرت النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم أنهم قد انطلقوا. I came. I told the prophet that they left. فجاء حتى دخل فذهبت أدخل. So the prophet entered. I want to enter after the prophet. فَأَرْخَى الْحِجَابِ بَيْنِي وَبَيْنَهِ I went to enter the Prophet's house, he put down the curtain, he didn't let me come in. هَذِي أَوَّلْ مَعْنَى لِلْحِجَابِ This is the first meaning of hijab. حُجِبَ أَنَسْ هَذِي الْآيَةِ نَزْلَتْ فِي سَنَةِ خَامِسَةِ And it's only 15 years old. This came out in the fifth year or the sixth year, he's 15 years old. It's the first meaning of the hijab. مَهُ السِّطُّ لِلْوَجْ that came down in the ayat Ukhra. وَلْيَضْرِبْنَ بِخُمُرِهِنَّ عَلَى جُيُوبِهِنَّ That's in Surah Al-Nur. وَقُلْ لِي أَزْوَاجِكَ وَبَنَاتِكَ وَنِسَاءِ الْمُؤْمِنِينَ يُدْنِينَ عَلَيْنَهِنَّ مِنْ جِلَابِي بِهِنَّ And at the end of Surah Al-Ahzab. This ayat Hadijab means there's no ikhtilaq. That's the first meaning of hijab. I'm the most, I know the most knowledge. I have the most knowledge concerning this hijab. What did it mean? Anas couldn't. Man who Anas, Anas couldn't come in his house. Huwa khadim, Rasulullah. Huwa khadim, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Then this ayah came down after that. And after that, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam qali, Iyakum wadduhul ala nisa. I warn you from entering upon 
the women. We already noticed the Khadim can't enter. Anas can't enter. Khadim can't enter. Okay, we know the Khadim can't enter. What about the brother-in-law? Now, yani, Akriba Azzawj. Adil Hamu. Akriba Azzawj. Akhuhu duna abihi wa jaddi. Akhuhu wa ammu wa ibn ammi. What about the, the family of the Zawj? Qala al Hamu. Al Hamu and Maut. Nah. That's the ablag. Ma huna ke kenima ablag min hada. For awwala ma nurid an nafham. Min ayat al ijab. The first thing we want to understand. What changed? Fi muamalat al muslimin. In the, in, the, in the actions of the Muslims, uh, that the men was separated before the, from the woman, and that, that hijab is a hajj, is a wall, is a barrier between the men and the woman. Nasallah subhanahu wa ta'ala ya ina na jameen ala ta'ati. Inna hu aliyu dhalik wal qadir alayh. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam.